us. So what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, I'm in my new place. It feels like it took forever to get here. What I wanna do is go ahead and insert some clips of me moving everything, process to get here. So I really wanted to do like a um, fast motion of me unboxing everything, but in between the move, I wasn't showering, I didn't shave, like it was just so stressful. So I couldn't do any of those things comfortably. Definitely didn't show the whole unpacking process. Sorry, this the spot I'm sitting at is kind of awkward. I'm gonna have to figure out where I want my ring light set up because I always had a spot that I would go to um, at the apartment. In this house, I don't know where my spot is yet. I'm still trying to figure that out. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It definitely was a process to get um, everything unpacked between work. I think the hardest part was that I would have to move everything and then afterwards go to work and come home, sleep, and then do it all over again. And so it was really wearing on me. And then when I got to the process of unpacking everything, um, it just felt like never ending. Uh, moving into my apartment that I moved into two years ago, I didn't have anything. All I had was my clothes and a few things, but I really didn't have furniture because um, I always had roommates and they always had the furniture. So um, in that apartment is where I acquired literally all of the furniture. Um, my roommate at the time when we moved in, we were supposed to split everything 50-50. Thank the Lord, he ended up not doing that. So I kept everything when we had split apart. So I'm settled in and I'm so excited and I can't wait to make new content in this house. But yeah. Uh, so, so, excuse one, the lighting to my face. I kind of wanted to document this because I know I'm going to do like a moving video on my channel, but I'm just starting. So I have everything in the living room. So what I'm going to move, I'm going to move everything I can in my car by myself because um, I don't want to reach out and then someone be like, oh, well, I'm doing this or I'm doing this. And it's always going to be an excuse. So with myself, there's no excuses. So we're going to start. I will give you guys an update when I make some progress. This is, mind you, this is the first load. It's like 7.30 in the morning. I made sure to wake up early and uh, start because it's been snowing, so I haven't been able to do anything. So I want to take advantage of the clear day before I go to work. So yeah, I'll update you guys. Okay, so we have the living room area. I love the windows. It's so echoey in here because there's nothing in here kitchen this is honestly my favorite part even though it's kind of like outdated ish um there's so much storage which is awesome oven fridge um this is into the laundry room which is a shared laundry room also an ironing board so random but so cool i'll probably never use that and then we go to the bathroom which has a tub which is amazing that is one of my biggest things i'm like i want to have a tub medicine coming up oh that needs to be clean so then a little hallway closet then the room with my closet my closet is way 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 smaller than my other one so i did do a little bit of downsizing so that is the whole place. Definitely can't wait to like start setting up everything. So right now, because it's just me moving everything. So my goal is to get all the boxes I can here to before work. So let's get it started. Yay, first load is complete. I'm so excited. Also, sorry again for looking like this. This is unacceptable to be on YouTube this busted, dusted, and crusted. However, all my makeup is packed away. And even without, I'm gonna be moving all day, so I don't wanna put on makeup. It's fucking freezing. My lips are chapped. I haven't, all my packed away. This is so annoying, but 
this is why I'm gonna bang it out real quick. So I will be right back. SS, so this is load like six. I'm so tired. I've been going at this since like eight this morning. It's about to be 12. I've accomplished a lot though, and I'm going to accomplish a lot more. I'll show you guys my old apartment in a little bit i'm just gonna do a few more loads and then yeah i'll update you at the tv it was like blocking up here a little bit and then the my that's my room's entertainment center like stand or whatever a process i'm telling you what like i really am just so tired and the craziest part of all of this is i have to work afterwards like what the wrong with me Asa, oh my god, this update is insane. <laughs> I have to stop moving because I have to work in an hour and so I like want to shower and get ready and stuff. But let me show you the progress I've made. Mind you, this progress that I made is just me moving everything and in my Toyota Camry, which is like so small. I'm probably on trip like 11. I literally lost count, but let me show you the progress I made. So everything is gone. Remember all those boxes? So I'm about to go to the new place. So I will show you everything that I moved because it like shows no scale of it until you see it all at the new spot. So hold on real quick. Damn, I am tired. So I've been going at this since 7 a.m. So I'm gonna show you the progress that I made. If I had a truck, I literally would have been like pretty much done. I mean, some stuff I do need two people to lift, which is annoying, but I'm gonna show you the progress. So this is everything that I managed to move to the new spot. A lot of trips. I don't even know how many trips I've done, probably about 15 or so, fitting all this in my Camry. It was a lot of back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, most of it's here. So what I'm thinking is I will go home, shower, get ready for work, and then tonight I'm gonna clean the old apartment. And tomorrow is when I will come over here and it'll be like my official last day in the old apartment. There's like still a few things. I need one more box and there's a storage unit outside but all that can be taken in one swoop if i you know when i have my friend with a truck help me i just like haven't asked yet because i'm like i'm gonna do everything that i can on my own because i hate relying on people because they usually let me do that. so um but yeah okay so there will be another update when i get the rest of my stuff here so yeah uh, so, so it's been a day since I've seen you guys. I wanted to do a little update while I'm feeling this way, but I just feel so de defeated. It really sucks because I've moved everything in here and I don't have a truck. So like the last little bit of stuff I have to have a truck for. But with working late, my schedule doesn't really match up with anyone. So it's seeming like impossible to um, get the last little bit of stuff over here. I really just want to be done with that last apartment. It is so frustrating because between this and work, it's just so much. And it's it would be one thing if I had someone like like the trip ever. I'd probably done like 20 trips. To this new place and you know and i haven't even gotten to enjoy it at all or start unpacking um or decorating or anything like that and it's just like such a frustrating feeling right now but i know it'll all be worth it and i'm telling myself that but um i do i just dropped off a load i'm about to go back to the old apartment change and get ready for work so um Hopefully, I have a more positive update next time I see you guys. Also, excuse my chapped ass lips. It's cold. And of course, my chapstick is packed away along with everything else, dude. But okay, till next update. That's, uh, oh my gosh, it's like day three since I first started this. I'm moving the last bit of stuff. I just wanted to hop on here and because a friend, Justin, came through to help me. And I just wanted to throw um, out there how grateful I am. Just in the moment of it, I am really grateful, but I'm just really 
grateful that he went out of his way to help me because a lot of people said they would and they didn't. So, um, Justin, thank you so much. Um, but yeah, we're on load two and we're gonna do one more load after this then I'm gonna go to work, grab the McLeod's van and then do the last little bit by myself. But um, thank you, Justin. So the view is gonna be extremely different. Let me show you what we're working with today. <laughs> So this is my current situation. Everything, my whole life is packed away in boxes. I'm at the new place. Um, this place is a house versus an apartment, which is awesome because while I'm doing videos, it's gonna be way more comfortable because I don't have to worry about upstairs and downstairs neighbors um, and pissing them off. But it's complete chaos in this house. And so I promised myself that I would document this my ring light is packed away and i was going to unpack it to like do to have stand you guys up but it's just going to get in the way kind of thing everything's really in the way here it's so frustrating but i'm going to start i was going to record myself moving and moving all the stuff but um it's just not really possible so what i'm going to do is just Organize stuff as much as I can and then I will check back when I can stand up my tripod and have you guys in on this action. But I'm all moved into my new place. I literally, the only thing left at the old apartment is my baby Theodore. I'm not going to have him come here yet because looking around and there's just too much everywhere and Theodore would be so uncomfortable. He would go stir crazy because he would only have a little bit of space to walk in. So my goal is to set my baby up as much as I can. Work is amazing. They gave me the night off to uh, be able to get situated, as situated as I can get. I haven't had a day off and on my day offs, I have DUI classes. So my schedule has just been hectic. I literally am going insane right now, um, but I can't afford to miss work. So, I mean, I missed tonight and I'm kind of upset that I did because money, but um, at least I get to tackle all this. So I will be right back. Okay, so I thought I'd do a little update for you guys. I'm sitting down because my back is literally on fire. I'm doing the closet at the moment. Or just hanging up all the clothes that I can. Um, so my plan is to do, like, hit the clothes so that there's less boxes. And then I'm going to start pulling boxes from the living room into the room so that I can reorganize the living room. And then when it's where, when everything is where I want it, then I'll start unpacking the boxes. But... A process, I'll tell you what. Uh, but yeah, there's my update. That's uh, so a little update before I go to bed. I got Theodore, uh, obviously, because you could hear him lapping in the background. I wanna show you the progress I made. I didn't hit any boxes. I just like organized everything to where um, I think potentially I'm gonna have things. But let me show you. So we got the couch. Entertainment center, a little random dining area. I really wanted to keep that table. Yeah, so the vision is coming along. It is a process. I'll tell you what, um, computer area. And then in the room, I got my bed down, my TV down, and then my vanity and drawers. It's such a process. Like, I have the vision in my head. So yeah, I'm hoping by Tuesday it's completely done. And then we've got, I put the dining room in here. So that leads to um, a shared laundry room. And I don't want that entrance open. So I blocked it off with this dining room table um, because I, and I don't want, like, I mean, there's a lock on there. But yeah. So I am going to take out these contacts and go to bed. Um, day one was a definite success. Um, 
I probably went at this for about like three hours. I'm excited for tomorrow after I get off of work to continue on. The only thing that sucks is I have one more couch that was like, I was going to give it away on Facebook Marketplace, but people keep bailing which is very frustrating to say the least. So yeah, uh, that is the last thing in the apartment. And then I can be stress-free. I'm so stressed about it because it's so heavy. Like with this, the, with my couch, it's light enough to where I would have been able to like throw it down the stairs, whatever. If I like, if I wanted to scrap it kind of thing, like I want to do with this um, couch. But this couch is so heavy. It has two recliners. Hoping before work, someone will come through and help me. I asked my friend tonight, but he was busy. Um, so yeah. Theodore, what are you doing? It's like exploring everything. It's really frustrating. It's the last little bit. It's like once I finish this, then I can be like more, my mind will be at ease kind of thing. But I'm gonna go to bed, so I will see you guys tomorrow. you guys enjoyed that video uh the process again i cannot emphasize this enough it was such a process but i'm glad we're here tonight is actually gonna be my first night taking a bath in the new place i'm so glad and so grateful to be in a house theodore is allowed to run free so it was a lot it was hard in an apartment with a puppy because he would run around and then I would get yelled at. Like they would either knock up on the ceiling, um, you know, 
or whatever tactic they did. But um, if you guys did like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up down below. There's definitely going to be so much more content coming, especially now that I feel so much more comfortable because I am in a house. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. And don't forget, stay cut through. <laughs> Bye, guys. I just want to